But I'm trying to make a connection between the way music is promoted and the way drama might be promoted. Because live performance uh, is only part of what's going on, I think. And is the script, the, the play, open to remix, sampling, um, reworking for a three minute slot? That's that sort of question. Um, gradually, the the material does come come around that uh, makes makes this possible and can fit into a, a radio show. Um, but I'm I'm so, a lot of what I'm doing or, or including in the show is just working around that. So what what I've noticed and it may, it may fit. I don't know. We're going to going, going to explore it. Uh, there's an EduX festival happening in, in Exeter. It's part of the university uh, looking at online or digital um, ways of learning and education. So the, the one that's relevant at this point, and I'm sorry I've missed, I've, I can't, I don't know the date of, of the, because the, uh, the interweb is not, not quite there in the studio at, just at this time. But it's called Show Not Tell, using humanities to bring digital strategy to life. Ash Robertson, Helen Cox. Um, but you, you'll find um, what the what the date is. EduX Festival. Look for EduX Festival on Twitter, and that should should produce it. But that's oh, it's got the, the noises are coming back. Um, there's other ways of looking at this. If they're, if they're looking at humanities as a way of presenting a digital strategy, you could also look at how the digital promotion... Digital buzz, that's the other word to look for. I'm going to give up on this. The sounds... Unless it's... I don't know. It isn't my headphones because the music is, is OK. So here's, a, here's another... Um, by the way, just going, going back to Alicia Keys... Uh, she's got a tour in the States. Whether that comes to Europe, I don't, I don't know. But uh, the complete... Well, not complete, but the, there must be at least an hour of uh, the Santiago performance is, is on YouTube. And I, I don't think it will damage the uh, ticket sales in the States. So the idea of um, plays being sampled on radio or social media... Will that will that stop people going to theatres? I, I, I don't think so. 